Did you know that modern neurology accidentally proved medieval priests might have been onto something? Meet coprolalia, a neurological condition where people uncontrollably shout profanity and blasphemous words. They desperately try to stop, but their brains betray them with sudden bursts of the most offensive language imaginable. Sound familiar? Medieval exorcism records describe the exact same thing. Possessed individuals speaking unclean words through no fault of their own. Ancient manuscripts detail victims screaming blasphemies while begging for it to stop. Priests documented these uncontrollable outbursts as definitive proof that Satan had seized control of human tongues. Here's the kicker. Modern Tourette's syndrome patients experience identical symptoms. So either demons have been causing neurological disorders for centuries, or medieval priests were accidentally practicing neurology. The descriptions are so precise, you literally cannot tell if they come from today's medical textbooks or thousand-year-old exorcism manuals. Turns out the line between demonic possession and brain chemistry is disturbingly thin. Who knew Satan had such excellent diagnostic skills? 